hi folks, Robin here. I'm just uh, headed uphill here for a solo wild camp tonight. First, I just need to find a pitch, and I think I've identified one around about here. It's a bit windy at the moment. It's to get windier later, but the wind's to swing round to the southeast. So I'm hoping to get a bit of shelter round about here later on. It was really windy back up there, so I've dropped down a little bit and uh, just try to find somewhere that's a wee bit flat. I found this little spot here. Still got cracking views over Edinburgh, right across the fourth, so I think this will do. The winds are maybe 10 15 mile an hour just now, so it's not Right, I've got less than an hour of daylight, so I'm going to get pissed up. Well, that's twice it's rained on me today, and there's no rain forecast until the morning. So it looks like the forecast has got slightly wrong because tonight was meant to be actually quite nice. Anyway, the tent is up, I'm inside. I just need to get the sleeping mat and sleeping bag sorted and I can settle down. Capital view. Got half our seat right ahead of me there. So tonight I've got the, the Helm 1 compact. So I bought some of these, the old Delta pegs. I've got one in each main guy line there. And I've got the Eastern Nails and other points as well. So hopefully she's well and come down for the night. And we're on the boil, yeah, dancer. Tonight's tea is some macaroni cheese. Could have been in the house with the missus. Watching a film on Netflix. But no, let's come out and camp when it's windy and rainy instead. <laughs> Just literally waiting on my freeze dry meal to hydrate and I can have dinner. It's got about three, four minutes to go, so not too bad. I'm actually really hungry now. And then I don't know what I'll do for the rest of the night. Watch Coronation Street, probably. <laughs> All right, folks, just watched my Coronation Street. <laughs> I'm no kidding, by the way. It's my, it's my vice. Me and the missus watch that usually. Anyway, I'm back outside and uh, I thought there was somebody up there for seat flashing their head torch over at me. So there's me flashing my head torch back across and then I realised it was a lighthouse. Never mind. <laughs> so there's the tent. Hopefully you can see that. I've ramped up the ISO so the camera can pick it up. So if it's a little bit grainy, I do apologise. That there is the moon, Ovs. And just to the right of the moon, the camera's never going to pick up, but I reckon that's Mars, it's got a red tinge to it. So it's just before nine o'clock. And that is my view. Not too shabby. Anyway, I'm going to retire back to the tent because it's getting cold. I should have wore warmer trousers for this, so I could stay longer. All right, that's me back in the tent. When I was outside there, I was actually like looking across the city and thinking there's like half a million people out there going about their own business. Is there any crimes happening? And then I saw a police car cutting about the streets. But aye, it's, uh, it does get you thinking that. Right, so I'm going to check the weather now and it is just past nine o'clock and it's seen the wind gusts are about 18, drops to 13 and up to 15 and then into tomorrow, 16, 18, 24, 25, 29 at 4 in the morning. So it's going to start touching 30 mile an hour at 4 in the morning. Now bear in mind, this is just the Met Office general forecast for Fair Mill Head, which is just below me in Edinburgh. So I'm sitting up at uh, around 300 metres, so it may be a little bit stronger. It's an east south easterly, so it's going to be coming from sort of behind me there. Right, that is 20 to 2, and I've just been woken up. 
actually was having a really good sleep up until about five, ten minutes ago. Good morning campers. I've actually just woke up again, it's twenty past five and yeah the weather's picking up a little bit. I reckon the wind speed's about twenty to twenty-five. Might be overestimating that, might seem worse than it is when you're inside a tent. But the little helm compact one is doing really well. Really chuffed with it. Is this an insight into winter 2021? Just wind and rain with odd snow shower. It's just after six o'clock now. There's a little lull and I don't see the point in sitting out for two hours waiting on first light, so I'm going to bail out just now. Yeah, so I'm where that little red dot is, just flashing away there. You can see there's a path just to the north from about 70 metres descent. I can just pick that up and follow that back to Swanston and then my car is just in here. Alrighty folks, that's me ready to go. Leave no trace as always, I know you'll not be able to see, but here's my pack. I need to figure out some better storage for the Delta pegs. And I probably only needed four of them last night for this particular tent. I need to make sure they don't fall off on the way down. Well, I definitely made the right decision to camp fuller down. The speed that those clouds are moving, I would have got battered fuller up. And even just dropping another five metres here and it's so calm. Alrighty folks, that's me back in the car. I'm going to wrap this video up. So if you've enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. And here's some other films you might want to watch as well. So thanks and I'll catch you next one. Cheers.